Okay, we got Queen of Wands in the upright position. So this is overall, you know, you. Or this could be your person. You know, this Queen of Wands, somebody that's very, somebody that's very spiritual. And they're, you know, a leader. They have control of their own life. They're very confident in the life, you know, that's in the skin that they walk in. This person is very attractive, very, you know, talented, talented and outgoing. And they're gifted. They're goal oriented. They're like a trendsetter. Knight of Cups and Nine of Wands. So somebody wanted to connect with you. With this Knight of Cups and then the Nine of Wands is here. They did something over and over and over again. This Knight of Wands energy could be somebody that was trying to finesse you. Because they were attracted to you. So they wanted to try to come in and you know. Be your Knight in Shining Armor. In this Knight of Wands energy. Or to just leave you, you know, feeling left alone, abandoned. So they were trying to finesse you, love bomb you, Knight of Cups and Nine of Wands. Knight of Cups and then Nine of Wands. They did something over and over again. Because they, they were attracted to you. And they wanted to come, they wanted you to... Yeah, three of cups. They wanted you to um, connect with them in some type of way. Knight of Cups is, you know, all about connecting with a person. And, and they did something over and over again. Three of Cups. This could have been a third party individual. To you or to your person. And they were in a childish energy. So this could have been somebody that was younger. This Three of Cups energy. They wanted to connect with you. This could have been a friend of yours, a friend of your person's. And they did something over and over and over again. Ace of Pentacles. Yeah, I'm hearing that they knew that somebody was attracted to you, that they knew this could have been somebody, as I said, your person knew a third party individual around your person, a karmic or just a third party individual. This could have been somebody that was close to them, this three of cups. And they knew your person wanted to connect with you and your person was nervous. Nine of wands. So they asked this friend to do something. Three of Cups and Ace of Pentacles. Could have been to give you an offer or ask you something. Ace of Pentacles. Because they were attracted to you, but they didn't have any confidence. As you're standing up in this Queen of Wands, you were very confident. Your person wasn't. So they went to a third party and tried to get them to connect with you because they were nervous. And they told this person to, you know, they wanted to offer you commitment. And this friend knew that. But Four of Pentacles is on the bottom of the deck. So they could have sat back and made it seem like they connected with you. Knight of Cups. And you told them that you, you didn't want to be in a relationship. This friend went back and lied. And they didn't even contact you. Yeah, Four of Pentacles. They, this is something that this, this friend is holding back at the Four of Pentacles. They don't want your person to know that they never contacted you because they knew your person wanted to commit to you. Yeah, but your person found out that they got exposed. The sun card is here. They knew that you made your person happy. They knew your person would be at peace around you. And they got exposed for whatever they, you know, did. Whatever lie they told over and over again, they had to keep covering up to tell another lie and another lie and another lie. But they held that back from your person. They didn't want your person to know that they never reached out to you. Yeah, because they knew your person wanted to commit to you. King of Pentacles. And Queen of Pentacles. <laughs> King of Pentacles, Queen of Pentacles. They knew that you wanted to commit to your person. 
and your person wanted to commit to you. Or they just overall look at both of you guys as king and queen of pentacles, somebody that's very stable, very oriented, you know, all around the board, jack of all trades, and um, very nurturing to each other. Y'all would have been because y'all do that, you know, to people. And that's how this three of cups person was looking at you and your person. And they knew your person was trying to manifest you. The musician is here into their life, but they didn't have enough confidence. So they, you know, thought that they would get behind the scenes with a third party and try to get this third party to connect with you because they were nervous. They got nervous around you because of the type of confidence that you have. This queen of wands energy. Yeah, so they left your person at a two of wands not knowing which way to go. They wanted your person to, you know, not be able to make a proper decision. And they thought they had control because your person went to them nervous. So they felt like they had control over the situation as your person, you know, walked in this nervous energy. So that made this three of cups thinking that, hey, I got control over this. I can, you know, be smarter than, you know, your person behind the scenes is what they thought. But they got exposed. Yeah, they got exposed. And your your person ghosted this person. The hermit card is here. They went within to investigate and started using their own intuition. And they gained inner knowing and knowledge about this three of cups person. They found out this person never even contacted you. Yeah. And you thought your person just walked away from you, eight of cups. This friend got behind the scenes and lied to your person. Could have said that you didn't want anything to do with them. They reached out to you and you didn't want nothing to do with your person. You were holding back or you wanted to be single and stuff like that. And it was all a lie. Yeah, your person had to realize they had to stand up and have confidence. King of Wands. Lead, lead their own life. And they had to walk away from this person because this person is toxic. They had to ghost this person with the Hermit card and did Eight of Cups. So they can stand up and lead their own life. Because they, you know, they were in an inner, they were in the energy of a person that was, you know, didn't have confidence. They seen you attractive as well, but they didn't want you to, your person to connect with you. And they didn't want you to connect with your person. They wanted both of y'all to be at a two of wands, not knowing which way to go. And they thought that they were making decisions and had control over this connection. Yeah, all because they knew that you were in love with your person or you had love for your person. You're somebody that's a queen of cups. Somebody that's very loving, caring. You're very intuitive. And you, you know, you're very forgiving and have emotions. You can, you can balance your emotions out in a mature way. And you, you know, very loving, caring, and forgiving. If you have kids, you take care of your kids. You're very, you know, very giving and nurturing mother. Yeah, you're somebody that's that's a healer. The star card is here. And that's how your, your person look at you as a healer. And this is why they didn't come towards you. It hasn't been any contact because they were nervous to contact you. And they, you know, went to a third party behind the scenes that they thought they could trust. And it was all designed to happen that way because they needed to know that they needed to ghost this person, walk away from this person because they're toxic. Because they didn't know this was somebody that was close, this Three of Cups. As I said, it could have been a friend. It could have been, you know, somebody that they, you know, got together with and celebrated with on a regular. Yeah, Page of Cups. Your person was very emotionally immature. They didn't know how to express the way they felt towards you. They got real nervous when they would come around you. With this page of cups. They were in love with you. But they just didn't know how to express it to you. Because you're this queen of wands. And they had to stand up and be this king of wands. Yeah they want to apologize to you. This person lied and made it seem like you wanted to be single. And yeah they want to come in union with you four wands. They know that you're their person. They know that you, you, you guys share the same soul. Four wands. But um, this person got behind the scenes and they knew 
They knew that you guys were twins is what I'm hearing. That's why this four wands popped out. But your person had to realize that they were in a childish energy. They didn't need, they shouldn't need anyone to speak for them. They had to build their confidence up to know that they're enough to reach out to you their self and match your energy. Yeah, they realized this person was at the five of swords, wanted to sabotage them. They were jealous of them, envious of them, and they were hating on them. And this was all a secret. The moon card is here. They ended up getting exposed. Somebody spoke the truth about this. Queen of Swords. And your person rejected this person. Four of Cups. They started rejecting this person. And they left this person out in the cold. Five of Pentacles. This person got upset. Knight of Swords. They got mad. Your person was mad. As this person got upset and started spreading lies, rumors, and gossip. Because your person knew something was off. They knew that you had love for them. They didn't understand why would you reject them. So they started going within to investigate. And they found out this person was jealous of them, envious of them. And it was all a secret. Yeah, it was all a secret. Somebody spoke the truth about this person. They got exposed. And your person was in regret, five of cups. They were in regret, feeling ashamed. You know, they could have been in regret for not being, you know, feeling confident enough to talk to you or express the way they felt to you. And it could have been because they were around this energy that was very low vibrational that they needed to leave out in the cold, five of pentacles. Yeah. And that's the truth, Ace of Swords Clarity. They gained truth and clarity. They needed to leave this person out in the cold and ghost them. Because they were in a low vibrational energy, you know, staying around that person. And that's why their confidence was low. Your person is somebody that's, you know, could be somebody that's very successful, well known. They just see you as somebody that, you know, they hold in high honor as well as what I'm getting with the Six of Wands. Somebody that's very successful, you know, you attract a lot of attention. And that kind of made your person nervous. Yeah, they felt betrayed, Ten of Swords. They felt betrayed and backstabbed by whoever this friend is or this third party. That was close to them. This was somebody that was close to them. This could have been somebody in their family. It could have been a friend of theirs. Eight of Swords had popped out. This was somebody that was close to them, though, that wanted them to be stuck. Eight of Swords and Ten of Swords. So they did something where this person was ended up, you know, went to jail. They could have went to prison with this Ten of Swords. Or they could have been, you know, facing jail time or prison entrapment. And they didn't know it was because of this third party individual somebody that they thought they could trust they got jealous and envious because they found out that you were attracted to your person as well so as your person was attracted to you and they were nervous to contact you this person found out king of wands popped out you were very attracted to your person you're in love with your person queen of cups and you had some type of emotions and love for your person. This made this person envious. Five of Swords. Yeah, this made this person envious. And they wanted you to feel rejected. They wanted your person to feel rejected. And this was all a secret. The moon card is here. It was all a secret. They knew that you guys were twins for wands. But they wanted y'all both to feel rejected. Because they're low vibrational. Five of Pentacles. Yeah, King of Swords and Judgment. They're going through karma. As soon as your person cut them off, King of Swords, speak the truth to them and cut them off because they no longer serve purpose in you, your person's life. They went through karma. They've been under judgment. For whatever they did, you know, that was 
that was wrong, stuff that they didn't have to do. They didn't have to do that to your person. But this person is somebody that's a low vibrational energy. Yeah, they're toxic. They're the devil. They're binded to bad habits and obsessions. They could have became obsessed with you. Obsessed with watching you. Trying to figure out how can they get you to, you know, have love for them. With this Knight of Cups and Nine of Wands, they did something over and over again as they knew your person was nervous. Yeah, they look at you as an empress. Somebody that can embody every queen in the deck. A divine feminine energy. Yeah, Ace of Cups in the reverse. This is somebody that don't love their self. Um, they don't want you to love yourself. Or they didn't want your person to be in love with you. Because they look at you as an empress. They were attracted to you. So they don't want your person to be in love with you. Ace of Cups in the reverse. They could have did something to try to confuse you. And it didn't work. They could have wanted you to be in love with them. And the Ace of Cups is in the reverse. Yeah, the death card is here. It was an ending that, you know, happened. Your person put an end to this situation. They wanted to put an end to your person being in love with you, being attracted to you. And they thought they would lower your person's confidence behind the scene by doing something over and over again because they knew that your person was nervous. But it didn't work. It made your person go in hermit mode. It made your person start being stingy with time, money, energy, holding back. And it also made your person walk away from them because they're toxic and become this king of wands. Stand up in their own, you know, energy and lead their own life and have their own confidence. To come towards you their self. Yeah, page of wands to communicate with you their self with this page of wands. Four of swords. They put their self in isolation and in solitude. They were reevaluating their life. As they had been away from you. That's why they hadn't been around for sorts. They had been in for, you know, solitude. Laying a situation to rest. In isolation. Cleansing and healing. From everything that they had went through. And we reevaluating their life. Because they want to build with you. Three of Pentacles. They want to work with you on some type of, you know, project. But this person that was trying to keep you all isolated, whoever this third party individual is, that was close to your person, this could have been a, you know, friend of theirs or this somebody that was close. They were attracted to you as well. They were working with other people behind the scenes to keep y'all isolated. Yeah. The Emperor and Nine of Pentacles. So they could have been working with a brother, I mean a father and a sister to try to keep y'all isolated. As these two, you know, cards popped out, Nine of Pentacles and the Emperor. So it could have been a father figure with this Emperor card. And then this Nine of Pentacles could have been like another, you know, a brother or a sister of your person's different family members and they got behind the scenes at the three of pentacles with this friend of your person's um they wanted to you know they they made a pact to try to have y'all isolated in the past six of cups this is stuff that took place in the past with the six of cups and then seven of swords they were being sneaky and deceptive behind the scenes Thought that they were smarter than you and your person. That they had some type of control. The emperor is here. They thought they had control over the connection because your person was nervous. And wanted somebody else to speak for them because their confidence was low. They didn't know their confidence was low because they needed to cleanse their self. Go into isolation and in solitude. Rehabilitate their self. You know, their energy. Recharge their energy and cleanse. You know, negative energies up off of them. And sail away at the Six of Swords from things that no longer serve purpose in their life. Yeah. And that's the truth. Ace of Wands is here. This card means yes to me, but 
this person wanted to sail away, was being divinely guided to sail away to connect with you, to start a new beginning with you, have an intimate conversation with you and didn't need these third party individuals to help them. They had to build up their confidence because it was low. They had to be placed around low vibrational energies that, you know, kept them vibing low where they didn't feel like they were enough for you. And they, you know, connected with you in a childish way. As they, you know, had third party individuals behind the scenes that became obsessed with you. And didn't want you guys to connect. They rather sabotaged the connection and thought they had control. Yeah, they were, they were sending conflict, five of wands. They wanted to, you know, place conflict amongst you and your person. They could have made it seem like you wanted something, you wished ill will on this person, or you said something negative about this person. They wanted you to think that your person just, you know, ghosted you or, you know, didn't contact you back when, you know, the last time you spoke with them. And the whole time they're trying to create conflict between you and your person. They lied to your person. Made it seem like you were dramatic or... Something happened where they made it seem like you said something negative about your person. And they never even reached out to you. Yeah, your person was at the Three of Swords heartbroken, depressed when they found this out. They were depressed because these were people that was close with this Three of Cups. They like got together with them on a regular. Close friends, close family members. And they got together to try to keep y'all isolated. Half of them were, you know, at the five of wands. So it could have been a fe feminine energy that was at the five of wands, was jealous, wanted to compete with you, secretly be you because of who you are, the confidence that you stand up in. And then it, the, the, it was two other, you know, masculine energies behind the scenes that were attracted to you as well. So they just slipped themselves at the five of wands with your person and with you to keep y'all apart. Yeah, your person was at the Three of Swords heartbroken when they found this out because your person was only equal with them, always given to them, Six of Pentacles. And they had no reason to do that. You know, your person was loyal to them. And they were heartbroken at the Three of Swords. Yeah, Two of Cups is here. They were heartbroken when they found out that, you know, they did this to you. And them as well. As they did stuff to you behind the scenes. The people that were around them. And they didn't know. It's like whatever they did to you. It came back on your person. And your person didn't understand why. It came back on them. Until they isolated themselves. And went in solitude. They went in you know, harmony mode. And started going within to investigate. And they realized whatever happened to you. It just came back on them. Equal give and take. Because they were attached to these same energies that were trying to send conflict to you. Five of Wands. Because you you guys have the same soul. Two of Cups is here. Yeah, they, they needed to go through this so they can complete a cycle. The world is here with these, you know, third parties. That they didn't, you know, they were heartbroken when they found out. But they didn't understand that they were just placed around a lot of karmics. As they were out in the cold, as your person get woke, as you get woke, you sail away from things that no longer serve. And that's what your person had to do. They just didn't know that these would be the people that they would sail away from. They didn't know these would be the people that was not a part of their Ten of Pentacles. And they found that out. They were at the Three of Swords Heartbroke. They could have found this out through Tarot. Page of, so I mean, Page of Pentacles. Your person could have got a reading. And found out the truth about these uh, third party individuals that were close to them with this Three of Cups. People that they were around on a regular, like everyday basis. Wanted to sabotage the connection. Yeah, they found out they weren't loyal. The hair fine in the reverse. These are people that, you know, I can't commit to. These are people that I cannot trust. They're disloyal. And they were no longer, you know, being around them or trusting them. Yeah, they moved forward. The chariot is here. It made them want to move forward after gaining clarity. Yeah, nine of swords. 
They can't even sleep at night because they want to come towards you. With this nine of swords. They did a lot. I'm hearing um, your person, you know, they, they can't sleep at night because they want to come towards you. But I'm also hearing that these third parties did a lot of stuff, you know, slander, gossip, sleepless nights. They wanted you to, your person to be in your head, in their head about some stuff that was lies. You didn't even say this about your person. You don't even know these people. They never even connected to you. So your person, they thought that your person would just believe the lies, nine of swords, and they would be at a mental prison in their head trying to figure this situation out. As lies were told on you, they never even contacted you or connected with you. And your person could have also found this out in a dream that they never contacted you. Nine of swords is here. Your person was sitting back in their head trying to figure out why would you think this about them? And they realized they could not trust this person or these third parties. All because they didn't want you to commit to your person or your person to commit to y'all to you because they looked at y'all as equal, balance, equal give and take. Like it was too good to be true. So they thought they had some type of control over this connection. And now they're sitting up at the nine of swords. Going through slander, gossip, sleepless nights, and being exposed for everything that they did out of hate and jealousy to you and your person. To try to sabotage their connection. Yeah, it backfires. Seven of Wands is here. They wanted your person to be in their head, could not sleep at night, sitting back trying to figure a situation out. And as lies and slander was being spread on you, it backfired. Now the truth is coming about out um, on them. Seven of Wands. About them trying to create blockages. Yeah, and slow down this connection. Knight of Pentacles. Now they're sitting at the Two of Pentacles trying to figure out how can they balance this situation out. Trying to figure out how are they going to balance this situation out when they've already been exposed, Nine of Swords, for being disloyal, here in the reverse. All because your person made a decision, Three of Wands, a final decision to come towards you. And that decision is still final. These third party individuals just had to get exposed. Yeah, they were mad. Tempers in the reverse. They didn't want a situation to be balanced out. They were angry. They don't have any love in their life. They don't have any balance in their life. And they took it out on your person. They took it out on you behind the scenes. Because they walk in low vibrational energy. Yeah, King of Cups is here. Your person is in love. This made your person in love with you. So if they were at the Page of Cups emotionally immature before... Because they knew you had love for them. And they wanted to connect with you, but they were nervous. Now that now your person's at the King of Cups. Their heart chakra is open. Yeah, Knight of Wands. And they want to come quick towards you. Knight of Wands. Yeah, because they're in love with you. The lover's card is here. They know that you're their soulmate. They know you have love for them as well. They just had to, you know, realize that they needed to use their own intuition. They needed to cleanse their self. They still needed to do work on their self to gain up their confidence. And know that they're enough and know their worth. So they needed to heal more. Because they were blinded from the truth to a sword. To these people that they were, you know, around. Three of Cups. People that they were close to. People that they were committed to, but they didn't get that same loyalty back. Yeah. Seven of Cups. And then Ten of Wands. They wanted your person to be confused. Way down, feeling like, you know, this left your person at the Seven of Cups confused. They wanted your person to be, you know, way down, feeling burdened, feeling pressure. They were confused because they knew that you had love for them. Um, the, your person didn't know that they wanted to keep that person, your person in a low confidence where they didn't feel like they were enough. 
because they didn't feel like they were enough and they were attracted to you and then another person wanted to be you and they didn't feel like that they were enough so they took it out on y'all behind the scenes secretly thought that they would throw a lot of stuff in your person's face that they didn't see and put a lot of stuff on their back that they couldn't weigh and your person would just be confused going through illusions and confusions dealing with multiple options they did not have love for them they were just toxic options yeah it just made your person want to take a leap of faith towards the unknown because it made your person watch you page of swords it made them watch you you know more observe you um they want to you know take a leap of faith towards you to have a new venture in life the food car and page of swords Nine of Cups, High Priestess, and Tower. Yeah, they look at you as um, wish fulfillment. Nine of Cups. And a lot of people that, you know, wanted to keep stuff hidden with this High Priestess and Tower, they're sitting back. Everybody that was behind the scenes, these third-party individuals, they're sitting back going through Tower moments. Sitting back dealing with an overflow of bad choices because they thought they had control over you and your person's connection because your person had trusted them. But what they didn't know that they had been got exposed a long time ago and your person no longer trusted them. They were testing them. Yeah, 10 of cups in the reverse. Your person don't even look at these people as family no more. They realize they're family. You know, these are people that they were, you know, connected to and they looked at as family and these were actual family members who did this. And they don't even, you know, look at them as family no more. Ten of Cups in the reverse. They don't even feel like that they love them. Yeah, they look at you as their Ten of Pentacles. They're only looking at their fortune. And these, they're, they're not happy, these third-party individuals that, that was trying to keep whatever they did hidden. And now they're going through tower moments and they're not happy. Ten of Cups in the reverse. Because, you know, you all have a Ten of Pentacles, a legacy, generational wealth that y'all will create here on Earth together. And they're not a part of y'all fortune, y'all future. They thought they had control of it. But yeah, they not they don't have control where the fortune is here. You guys still are, de you know, still faded. And this was faded to happen. And you all are a part of each other's destiny, each other's purpose. And the will will turn in you all's favor with this will of fortune being here. Your person chose to heal. Yeah, eight of wands is here. Your person is coming towards you quick. Quick forward movement. Yeah, they want to come towards you quick and invest or build on this connection. Seven of pentacles. The hangman, justice. So... Some type of way these third parties got wrapped up in the justice system with this hangman. They could have set, got behind the scenes and did something for your person to be wrapped up in the justice system. They could have did something, you know, for you to be wrapped up. Because as I say, somebody was at the five of ones with you. And then people were at the five of ones with your person for you. So it's like all this is going on behind the scenes. They wanted y'all to feel stuck and wrapped up some type of way in the justice system. The hangman and the justice uh, card is here. Because they couldn't confuse y'all. They could not throw any pressure on y'all. It's like the more and more they tried to seven of cups, place y'all under illusions and confusions, it placed the weight on them. It had a lot of stuff in their face that they couldn't see and a lot of stuff on their back that they couldn't weigh. So they felt burdened. They felt pressure. They were running around in circles and trying to cover up everything that they kept doing. And they just kept getting exposed. Yeah, it made it made your person want to work on their self, Eight of Pentacles. And it made them grow. Strip card is here. Whatever they did to you, it just made you grow. It made you continue to keep working on yourself. And it just gave y'all strength. You know, y'all had already been through a lot. And whatever that, you know, they did, it did not kill y'all. It only made y'all stronger. 